Thank you for taking the time to view another ARC Excel demonstration. In this video, we will introduce viewers to our release of ARC Excel details now made available at no charge to qualifying U.S. and Canadian-based architects and architecture firms. The primary purpose of ArcExcel built Revit details is to drastically reduce or eliminate the production costs associated with detailing and maintaining office detail libraries. ArcExcel has created an architectural library of completed details numbering in the tens of thousands. We know of no other detail library on this scale made freely available to architects from a single source in either CAD or BIM format. We are now able to make our detail library free of charge to architects because building product manufacturers have recognized the value of placement of their product information at your fingertips. All of our detail components and annotations include hyperlinks that take you either directly to a detail component sponsor's product pages or our directory of manufacturers that produce products associated with these components or annotations. We strongly encourage ArcExcel users to frequently visit these sponsoring web pages to become acquainted with the building product manufacturers that are providing you more productive time and profitability. While ArcExcel details have always made architects more productive and profitable, having free access to our library further eliminates any perceived cost barrier that may have been associated with the use of these details. We estimate that the cost of producing construction details for use in Revit-based projects normally accounts for 15% of total architectural project production cost. Reducing this figure to 5% effectively doubles standard project profit margins. Since our first release, we have made other changes as well. For example, it is no longer necessary to complete the configuring of all construction types prior to selecting your details. However, if you plan to download several details in any one visit, configuring your roof, wall, and floor construction types first remains the most efficient method. These simple steps are all that are required to gain access to the ArcExcel Revit Built Construction Details Library. As with our earlier release, it will first be necessary to create a user account. However, new to this release are some further requirements of our end users. To be eligible for free downloads, you must be either a registered architect or an employee of a U.S. or Canadian architecture firm. A legitimate, verifiable phone number, email, and postal address are all required. This information will first be verified prior to our activation of your account. Gmail, Hotmail, and other such accounts are ineligible as email addresses. All email addresses must be associated with the domain of the architecture firm by whom you are employed. Once your information has been verified, you will then receive notification of your account activation. You may then log in to your new account. First, configure your construction types and define your details. For more information, view our demonstration video outlining the detail configuration procedures. Preview your detailed definitions. If your detailed definition is not found in our library, you should try some minor modifications to your previous definitions, and again preview your selections until you get a detail image. A preview image indicates the detail is available for download. Once you see a preview image, you may select the download button. Save the detail someplace where you will easily find it later and repeat the procedure for each detail you would like to download. Once you've downloaded all the details you would like for a single project, you may open your project and use Insert Views from File, then navigate to your Download Details and insert the appropriate detail views. Once they are all in your project, you may use the Callout and Section Mark tools. Check the box that says Reference Other View, and with the pull-down menu, find the detail you would like to associate with a callout or detail section mark being placed in your drawing view. Now locate in your current view where you would like to place the callout or detail mark. You should be able to find the ArcExcel details grouped together and located under Drafting Views. 
They can be dragged and dropped onto drawing sheets just like any other view. For more detailed instruction of these procedures, see our other demonstration videos. Always remember, though ArcXL details are provided in a nearly completed state, they should always be carefully reviewed and modified by the end user to ensure compatibility with your project design, intended construction methods, climactic and seismic considerations, as well as conformance with local building codes. ArcXL built details may contain errors and omissions. You should be fully aware that you and or your firm assume full responsibility for the use and review of these details as the official architect of record. We hope you found this demonstration helpful and informative. You'll find us on the web at archexcel.com.